New York State Cannabis Control Board approved 99 new dispensary licenses, including four in western New York. But still nothing here in the Finger Lakes region, as a federal lawsuit is pending. News 10 NBC's Ericetta Koss spoke with one frustrated applicant in Henrietta who's been waiting more than two years for approval. Ericetta. That's right. You may recall this lawsuit brought about by a Michigan-based company claiming the approval process is discriminatory against anyone out of state. This company wanted to set up here in the Finger Lakes region but was denied. The litigation has completely halted any movement in our area and one small business owner says they're at their wits' ends. I really want to be part of this cannabis community. Yeah, yeah. community. Ryan Martin co-owns MJ Dispensaries in Henrietta with his wife, Myla. We're cleaning all this up and we got some couches back here. They're mostly ready to open, but the journey of getting to that day is a slow one. We were open for a few months and we got a cease and desist letter on uh, March 28th of 2021 and our store immediately uh, closed its doors right after the letter was read. So we've been waiting over a year for the OCM to, you know, um, license us. Ryan and his wife were determined to jump through any hoops that came their way. They passed code enforcement and were 12th to apply for a conditional adult use license. But in November of 2022, the lawsuit happened, placing a halt on everything in the Finger Lakes region. They have been releasing licenses. I think there's 165 to this point after today. Um, in all the areas but the Finger Lakes. So it's, it's really f frustrating. Today, 99 new licenses were granted, while Ryan continues to pay rent, utilities, and check up on his security. For the time being, he's making ends meet in a rather creative way. I've been a professional poker player, uh, traveling to, um, you know, Vegas and Atlantic City. You know, I just really can't wait to uh, talk to the people again. You know, when I was open for those three months, you just, you got people coming in here with fibromyalgia, you know, um, PTSD, uh, ADHD, you know, cancer. And the state had no comment for us on this pending litigation, but some lawmakers like Senator Jeremy Cooney are speaking out. He says in a statement, quote, New York will not reach its goals for an equitable and thriving adult use cannabis marketplace until all regions are open for business.